Okay, good morning everyone present here. Okay, I'm very happy to meet you people after uh, three years for the purpose for what you have come here. Okay, so this day will be a remarkable, memorable day in your life to decide certain things in your life. Okay, so we'll go ahead and this program name is Wise Up, Rise Up. Wise Up here means you should uh, move from intelligence to wisdom, become wise. And you should not be sitting alone in a place, you should rise up. And you are becoming wise and rise, you are rising to reach your goals already set in your life. Okay. So I'm just going to push you there. Small push. Okay. So this will be the thing that we will be discussing today on or I'll be sharing these things. So initially I'll be introducing, then we'll be beginning, then we'll have meditation, then skills for the next gen, what is that you need to have in your life. Next, then I'll be giving certain lifelines. You know, no lifelines, when you are not able to find anything, you have certain things to connect, how to move forward. So we have lifeline, then continuous acts, then idols say, what does our idols say? Idol means uh, role models. Then we have know your power. After that, we'll be having a Q&A and, and a feedback session. Uh, so this will be the outline of today's session. Okay. So, what is that I can give you, people, so that you can carry forward in your life all together or always? I don't have anything as such. All that I have is the light here that can be shared to you people. So this is a small gift from my side, not physically though. You cannot see that gift. <laughs> Once in lifetime, if you face certain problems, you will be having a chance and remembering these things, you can better your life. That is the possibility. When I have given this gift, it will be beneficial only when you use it. If not, no. Okay. So I welcome you people to this fabulous session. Let's begin. Okay. So now I'll tell a story. There is a mango tree. And there is mangoes in that tree, which is very ripe, yellowish. And a man was walking that way. A man was walking that way. He saw that mango and he sat there. Why did he sit there? Because he was not ready to pluck that mango. The reason is he was lazy. He didn't want to get up, spread his hand, pluck the mango and eat. It was a bigger task for him. So what he did, he thought somebody will pass that way. I'll ask them so that they'll pluck it and give it to him. So he sat there. After three or four hours, there was a man on the horse coming that way. And this man who was sitting under that mango tree, he questioned that man on the horse. Can you please pluck this mango for me? So he said, I'm, I'm on the horse from three days and I'm still waiting to get down of the horse if the horse is going to stop somewhere. He is not ready to stop the horse. He was continuously moving. Okay. So both are. Now, who is lazy in this? Raise your hand. Okay. 
Who is lazy in this? Raise your hand. Raise your hand. Who is lazy in this? Raise your hand. Raise your hand. Hmm, you could. Okay. Ah. Who is lazy here? Those who rose their hands are lazy. <laughs> <laughs> What was my question? Here. <laughs> Who is lazy? Here. They both are lazy. That is in the story. But here, who is lazy means you lose your hand <laughs> is one thing. Okay. And the other people are too much lazy. They are not even ready to raise their hands. Got the point? Clear? So you want to be lazy again? Huh? No? Sure. Then claps. <laughs> okay, we are encouraging laziness, okay? <laughs> okay, we are encouraging lazy people. <laughs> so, we got to know who is lazy and we are moving from laziness to activeness. So, what is that second thing you are seeing there? Mm, throw your negatives. So most of the times we have something called as fear. Correct. The moment when I asked you people who is lazy here, so many people did not raise their hand because they have some kind of fear in them or some kind of negativity in them. I will not raise my hand. I should not be seen. Correct. And more than that, you have n number of negativities filled inside yourself, which is not known to anyone and which should not be not known to anyone. Correct. So now, I have given a piece of sheet to you. Yes? Yeah. Take out your pen. Write all the negatives that you feel which is in you. Okay. Whatever negatives you have about yourself, write one by one. Okay, finish writing all your negatives. And you have numbered those negatives, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, who has got 10? 10 negatives in them. Raise your hand for this at least. 10. At least 10 negatives. Okay. More than 10? More than 10, no? <laughs> okay. 5? All have got 5 at least, I guess. Huh? Uh, is there anyone who has only one negative? Only one? No, no. So almost all is having uh, 5 to 10. Okay, maximum 5 plus negatives. So this day, we are throwing away the negatives okay all those negatives that which was inside you you have bought it out it is on this sheet now right it is no more inside you okay all these days it was inside you and it was multiplying like chicken okay and today you have bought it out and now we are gonna Throw it away. Okay. See, I have kept the dustbin here. You hold that sheet. You want to hold that sheet. See that. Hold, hold. You see those negatives. See those negatives. For the last time. You want to see those negatives for the last time. And no more in future again you will be able to see those negatives in you. Now you are going to crush that sheet, okay? You have thrown all those negatives inside that. You have crushed it. If you want, you can spit on it. 
थ्रो थ्रो थ्री टाइम्स डोंट स्पीड मोर ओके थ्रो 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 ओके ना वन बै वन से गुड बाय टू दैट नेगेटिव एंड थ्रो इट अवे वन बै वन If you want, you can say goodbye. Don't keep the negatives. Throw it away. <laughs> Okay, now everyone has thrown away their negatives. Sure, how is that you are feeling now? Huh? You are feeling good, really? Huh? Then clap for yourself. For the first time after 20 years in your life, you have thrown away your negatives because we did not have the chance to throw it away. We were always carrying it. Correct? So. Finally, we have thrown away the negatives, and from today we are going to be only having positives. Correct? So, thanks for uh, burying so many negatives. Now I don't know how I will be able to carry that uh, dustbin with uh, full of negatives. Huh? I will do something with this later on. Hmm? Now, so we have found who is lazy and moved away from that. Then we found the negatives in us and we have thrown it away. And now we are, we are now, but we don't know what is that which is in us. Correct. So most of the times when we hear certain things or when we go to somebody else and he says something or she says something, what is that we do is. we say something else in return to them because we are filled with we are filled with opinions correct so there is a story a great renowned scholar who knows everything who thinks he knows everything goes to visit a saint in china okay master we call him as he goes there and after meeting him he says i am a big scholar i know everything in this world but still i have certain doubts which i want to clear from you so that master or that saint says please sit down and he places a tea cup for for the guest and he starts pouring tea for the guest and after some time the cup fills up and the guest starts shouting please stop it is overflowing please stop it is overflowing at that moment that master says to that guest similarly as the cup is overflowing with tea similarly even you are overflowing with your thoughts overflowing with your ideas overflowing with your opinions so if you want to benefit from this session or from this world or from this life my sincere request to you people is to keep your cup empty 
if you can keep your cup empty whatever little i have i can pour it into is it okay and similarly you are supposed to keep your arms empty so that whatever is available grace will be given to you so always keep your arms empty as well okay clear so we are going to begin now shall we yes, yes sir okay